hello from EDA in this tutorial I am going to show you how to use embedded database inside our Java application using h2 libraries for this first create a new project simple Java project called it as something what you want embed so now you have to download h2 libraries I have given link in description of this video so I have already downloaded this uh, here's it I have also extracted it go to bin folder here's it we need to include this file inside our project so go to netbeans right click on our project select properties click on libraries and click on add jar folders and select that file which I have already told you go to compressed <coughs> this folder bin and choose this file and click on open and ok so you can also check that the library is already added in our project so now implement this in our project so for this first we need to include the driver for this there is a class class name class cla class dot for name method so here we need to pass driver name which is org dot h2 dot driver this means this is address of this file or this class which is inside org dot h2 package you can simply browse it here org dot h2 here is a class as driver dot class so this class is which I have include here so we have to handle this as a exception S simply alt enter and sound by try catch <coughs> so I we have linked to driver now we have to give database name for this connection which is inside java.sql package create object is equal to driver manager dot get connection so we have to pass database url which is jdbc colon h2 colon till sign and enter name of your database which you want to create so in this example I am creating EDA logs DB now second parameter is username which is test by default and third is password which is also test so we also need to handle this exception just hit alt enter and catch this now we have made <coughs> made connection so we need to create a statement for this create a statement object make sure it's inside java dot SQL package not inside java dot net beans select java dot SQL and and object is equal to con dot create statement so now we ca we can execute queries using this statement object so simply st dot execute not execute query we need to execute and 
enter your SQL query so we we are just creating a simple table with one column of name so create table <coughs> pavan which will having name of type where care with 20 size okay so we will print a message to check whatever our table created or not simply to print here table created successfully so now run this we get table created so if we again run this this will throw an exception because this is this tape this database already created so now run this project again here you go you get an error org dot h2 dot jdbc that table name pawan already exists so this is simple tutorial that how to use h2 libraries in java project in next tutorial i will show you how to use h2 libraries in intel ij ide thanks for watching